Anderson, we're back. What's up? Episode three mm -hmm. of Slept On. We're going over our number eight picks of the most underrated slash slept on battle rappers alive in the world. And when I say in the world, I mean it like an American, so only in America. Yeah, obviously. obviously. Uh, don't you love that? In the yeah. NBA, it's like world champions. It's like, bro, we only played in America. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, NBA, NBA, like, that makes sense. That does make sense. That makes but sense. The NFL does it, too, where I'm like, world yeah. champions? Are you sure? Yeah. Um, uh, welcome back to Slept On, where me and Anderson go over our top 10 most slept on battle rappers. We did our 10... On episode one, our nine on episode two, you're getting the math here. The math is math, and today we will go over our number eights. Um, what are we doing? Who won the coin toss last time? You want to go first? I'll go first, first on this one. So to recap, we Dollar Bill. Recap. Recavic. Mr. Biscuit. Mr. Biscuit. Fresco. Fresco. Yeah. You just show, you just showed me a, a white dude you thought was good looking for two minutes. But I, yeah. Which I hope uh, this yeah. is not where it's going. Uh, love who you love. Uh, yeah. But, <laughs> But if you're like number seven, I have multiple agendas here. Okay. Number seven, Brian Gosling. Yeah. Like fuck, Anderson. He's not rhyming. I know. But like just this but seems incredible. Rhyming? Yeah, La La Land's just really good. I mean, everything's art. So, um, okay, who's going first? I, I'll, I'll go first on this one. Fire. Um, right. And uh, he better be fire, bro. Yeah. Fresco. Listen, I think Fresco is probably good. I I I couldn't. Stop thinking about the shirt he was wearing last night. Yeah, that was that was a pretty wild shirt. So good. Um, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with uh, with a guy that just because you were saying American, I'm gonna go with a guy that is not American. He is right. a French Canadian, so English is not even oh. his first language. But you would never know that talking to him or listening to him rap. Smack. Um, smack. Smack. Yeah. Smack. Cool. English is definitely not his first language, but uh, but uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, it is uh, it is Chrome. Have you ever heard of Chrome? Bro, you're three for three. All these right. Are all the, these are all the names I've heard yeah. about but haven't watched. All right, yeah. Is it a white dude? It's, yeah, I don't, yeah, I guess so. I guess he's white, yes. You're going to show me all white dudes, huh? No, I just heard you wreak havoc. The first one Fire. was, okay. uh, yeah, yeah. You got the affirmative yeah. action higher out the way? Yeah, <laughs> I got it. Yeah, I definitely have the, uh, I try to keep that in mind with like the, uh, but but you, you said, you mentioned, uh, you mentioned American and I was like, I want to get, I want to, I want to do someone that I feel like is, is, is an interesting character. Dope. Um, is, is it I battle? I battle. So dope. I only start realize like maybe this month that I battle books international rappers. Yeah. I did not know that. I'm so I'm so behind like I went to uh, an I battle event that booked this guy named RX Southside. Mhm. Mm well, I think he's from London. Yeah. It was so cold, bro. He was so fucking fire. I should have put him on this list, but like and then I went into iBattle and I'm like, oh, they have a tendency to book international. Yeah. Which is dope as fuck. I didn't know that. Shout out to iBattle. Yeah, bro. If there's if there's a definition of like for the culture, it is everything so iBattle dope. does all the time. <laughs> Lex Luthor told me, like, what he does, he wakes up and he looks for battles that have less than a thousand views, and those are the ones that he goes to. There's so many battles he hasn't seen that are like, you know, everyone's no seen shit. them, but he loves the battles that no one's seen. That's a tough gig, because yeah. I have an argument that, like, battle rap, when it's good, it's great, but when it's bad... Mm. And to think that Lex is just combing through a bunch of thousand view battles, which is probably 99% ass... Mm. I think though he looks for different things than like you and I would look for. I think he mm. one he'll laugh at people a hundred percent. So he'll do it and be That's like, he, it's like watching a car crash for some of it. But I think, I think he looks and he's very good at seeing potential. Dope. And he's like, oh, there's something here with this guy. I mean, so many stars that are like that came or coming up through I Battle is like Lex finding them and being like, oh, you're you're something, and like telling them like you're really good. Because doesn't Lex do wrestling promotion or some shit? Uh, I think he does too? some of that too, yeah. yeah. But he, he did that after the battle rap. He's like, he's getting into wrestling more, you know, because of battle rap, and they're so similar. So dope. So, so shout yeah. out to Battle Man and Lex. Chrome, yeah. why do you like Chrome? Chrome Chrome's really good. Um, I think, uh, well, he's interesting to me because he, A, he speaks French. That's his, like his first language, but you just, he sounds way cool. He sounds like a cooler American than me. Okay. So like you can't even tell. So it's really wild seeing that side. Um, but I think that uh, he, he's just one of those guys that when I think of like slept on battlers, I'm like, Chrome's up there because he's, he's really good. He just hasn't really gotten like as many shots I feel like he deserves. Um, but he always has bars that cause I haven't seen this battle in a long time. I just yeah. know of one or two lines in this that I was like, "Oh, this is insane!" That like I, I still think about. So, okay. um, yeah, Chrome is Chrome is fire. First round? Uh, I think this is a one. This is a one rounder. Chrome going first. Let's go. Uh, yo, what's good? I battle. Yeah. Listen, take Dex the homie. 
right? I don't really care who y'all think is the best MC, but I won't let you breathe. You ain't sick, you just got the symptoms, and they saying you're gonna die online like it's WebMD. You got home, oh, you got home oh, field wow. advantage? Well, that's not a problem. I ain't rocking a rope chain, it's gonna be hard to rob it. Dirt on him. Ah! Dirt on him. Ah! 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 Dirt on him. When a ratchet ring like she called to gossip. I'ma fold a bitch in his home game like Polly Pockets. Take oh! this. So many homies that I don't know what I'ma do with the bodies. Feel cocky when a toolie is on me. See, he gonna talk about all this shit that he gonna do to me probably. Till the kickback lift deck in the air like I'm doing an ollie. Woo! I do hate those bars. I do hate those bars where it's like, because the guy's name's Tape Deck, so like you're taking half of his name, and then it's it's everything we've kind of talked about. Oh. Where like like you're doing you're doing like a bar that's a name flip, and then also you're using like, and then it's uh, I don't know. I mean, this is also like four years ago, and battle yeah. rap changes so much. But that's an example of where I'm like, where I'm like, that's a it is like a it's a it's a it's a fine name flip, but it's one of those that I'm like nowadays I just I wouldn't do because it's just so easy to. You don't like him taking half of tape deck's name and flipping it i don't hate it i just i just feel like if you're gonna do it it has to be something like crazy. really crazy okay and that's one that like i could if you told me i was battling something named tape deck i would i could think of that in the first 20 minutes and do like you know you know uh feel it. but uh i can't remember if he, if he had a punch before that i mean if it's part of like a of like a chain of punches then it's totally fine but yeah. if like that's the main part of the thing then i'm not i'm not a big fan of okay. it but um uh, hated it before and i could tell he met all I'ma do is shoot till his head detached. A chopper lifting off his roof like it's a helipad. Yeah. I, never, yeah. I never missed. He tried to run, but he thought he was clever. Right. Old boy tried to duck a shot and got hit like I'm Conor McGregor. We Ooh. both got money. We both got money. Keep it that way. Don't go broke because you ain't doing enough. You try to borrow off me, you're going to look stupid as fuck. Even if you're panhandling, trying to get food with a cup. I'd rather give you a buck shot before I shoot you a buck. Flex it in that That's very good. Like I would have jumped out of my chair if that's, Calico said it. Yeah, you know, like, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's crazy. Story of a white battler's life, man. I tell you what. I tell you, well, Calico said it. You know, and Tay Rock would have yelled. That's, oh yeah, I know. <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah, so though. many times I'm like, oh, Calico would have gotten a reaction. Yeah, because it's freaking Calico, you idiot. Yeah. In every city. Pull up with ten grand and take off with a dime. Spending Manhattan rent money on bottles of wine. Can they? I like the, I like ultra descriptive shit like yeah. that. That like yeah. just painted a picture for yeah. me. Didn't have to. Yeah. Didn't have to be that descriptive, but that's yeah. what made that bar hit. It's also a great example of someone from outside of our country coming in and knowing everything about our country. Yeah. And then when we go over there, it's like we have Don't just no, no idea. Which is such a great I, I love that about them. Everyone hates that about Americans. I love it about Americans. Yeah. Because it's such a it's such a subtle flex where it's like like we genuinely like we just don't know because there's so many cool things we got back at our place like yeah. it's just so cool and it's like y'all can't help it's just the definition of hating from outside the club you know that's, <laughs> that's how i feel like you know? yeah like that's like a that's a deep level reference he knows about manhattan he knows about the rent prices yeah so like when people come to america they have to be ultra specific to get a reaction yeah. We'll go to London and be like, your London bridge is falling down. Yeah. That's the, like, the <laughs> deepest reason we'll go. And they're so flattered. They're like, you, no, you heard, you. You heard you. the nursery rhyme? That's a, <laughs> thank you. That means a lot to us. Thank you. That's been a number one hit in our country for a hundred years. <laughs> wow. Go! <laughs> Canadian banknotes. That's fucking fancy. Canadian banknotes. A dollar ain't as strong, but believe me, it's fine. These notes make magic happen like Ocarina of Time. <laughs> wow. I played that game. And lost more money than Thesaurus made in his life. <laughs> Talk Talk. Talk. Talk also, I'm crazy, pretty sure bro. I'm pretty sure Chrome hates Thesaurus. Does he? Yeah, because Thesaurus is like you know on Twitter, he's very he's like just like Antifa, you know, the account uh, on Twitter. Okay. And I think Chrome is more right leaning or is whatever he? whatever the equivalent of like you know the right is over there in, in Quebec. That's like what he is, and uh, it's just mad funny because it's just it's just funny. They're, they're beef. I love an excuse to like get a stray off. Yeah, yeah, it's that. really fun. <laughs> source made in his life yep. so i flew back to montreal and got brains from his wife oh. location on in every city 
I got mob ties and they don't joke with family. So chrome never hidden like open carry. See the, ah, see the snub no, no, see the snub no short, but it's story long. They got all these squares ducking like Porygon. See? Yeah. I love that. I really like that. Simple. It's very simple, but I, I just, I, it's, I was like, because Porygon's not even a duck, but we all get it. We're like, yeah. oh, it does look like a duck with mm -hmm. like square. I don't know. Yeah, Great I, shit. I, Pokemon's the only childhood reference thing, like 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 uh, franchise that I understand because I never watched wrestling or uh, any anime. Fuck, and so Pokemon's man. the only thing where I'm like, oh, I get y'all freaking out over that, bro. I've, I'm with you. I feel so outside of the club with with anything anime. Naruto, really? Pokemon, no. I never, oh, dude, bro. you, you strike me as like a person. like an anime guy. I know, and so like. Luke Castro will always rap it to me, or Ace Amin will always rap it to me. Yeah. I'm like, I guess that's fire, bro. Yeah. I, I don't know who this nigga Vegeta is, but like, cool. You know, like, yeah. I've never like really gotten with it. And the it's just grown bigger and bigger in battle rap, bro. Yeah. The references, I'm like, all right, man. Fuck. Yeah. I'm Vegeta. like, gosh, I used to make fun of people that watch that stuff, and now it's like really, really cool. And yeah, I had no idea. Exactly. I had no idea. That was, like, I'm the nerd word. now because I didn't watch it. That's <laughs> yeah, not how I'm sorry. shit went, you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I wasn't allowed to because it had, you know, violence in it. So, like, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I had to sneak the Simpsons going yeah. up. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. I'll get killed if I watch the Simpsons. <laughs> He's cold, though. I'm fucking yeah. this guy. See, I'm true tobacco, but stay with the can spitting. There's an eagle on me for anybody I catch slipping. Cause a racket with the birdie. We ain't playing badminton. Send a message when the lead drawn. Send a message when the lead drawn. Like the shit was handwritten and caught back on a bitch like reverse gender transitions. Oh! Bro. Cock That's the bar the that I was like, holy cow. That was insane. Cocked back on a bitch like reverse gender transitions. That no, one, I was like, cold, I was like, holy, that's just so f unbelievably fire. Okay, that's, you showed me Fresco last time. Uh -huh. I was on the Fenton Fresco. Yeah. This feels like Fresco if he was raised by Shotgun Shook. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> the, 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 I fuck with yeah, this dude, yeah. The, the, the shirt, the shirt's like, 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 you know, it fits a little bit better. I think also it's the fact again that like he's not American, so you just don't know what they're doing in Quebec. I'm like, y'all yeah. could be having shootouts every day. Exactly. I have no idea. Sure, you know, because it's not like it's not like Toronto where it's like, okay, the hardest person to come out of Toronto is Drake. Like, you, you know, like it's not, it's not like, it's not just like the like, like, like Quebec is just so. I just don't know anything about it, and Fact. so it's just so interesting. Uh, he's dope, man. I fuck he's with really him. He dope. sounds like the type of battle rapper that would make good music. I don't know if he does or not. Yeah, he yeah. Sounds I think, like I think he, he sounds does, good on I think he does make music. But it's so weird to listen to him speak French just so oh, fluently because yeah. he just does that. And it's mm -hmm. like, man, it's so interesting to just... Uh. <laughs> Talk back. Oh, it's like a verse trend. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> See when, I'm aiming, 20. see when I'm aiming the lead is for your head. See when I'm aiming the lead is for your head, bitch. So me raising a steel is called a deadlift. Right. I'ma make uh. you famous. They'll all know you once you're dead, kid. So I'm sending tape and his eulogy's like a press kit. See, yeah. Yeah. see yeah. Yeah. So I'm sending tape and his eulogy's like the press kit. See right. me squashing a beef, trying to dead shit. I'm recommending a clip like Netflix. Mm -hmm. His head split. His head split. You okay. see the French with a toast? It ain't breakfast. In short, you know I'm keeping a pound. Like Brexit. Hey. I'm on a God. God. I don't understand now, Brexit, bro. but I understand it enough to be like, that's He's a really good now, bar. Bro. Yeah, yeah. He's cooking now. Yeah. No, also, cold, I'm bro. getting recommended. A, like, while you're trying to, like, dead the shit, I'm getting recommended a clip, clip like, like Netflix. Netflix. That's, that's like, I, I love that. He's another example of like a white battle where you can kind of get away with that. Like where it's like there's a level of legibility. Yo, I'm on the road, and I'm ready to peel if he gets stupid. I got a plan to stretch out tape, and I'ma stick to it. Oh. And y'all knew, and y'all knew we'd rap about money and guns. I guess that's sort of the goal, that YR shit. Pistol slides covered in gold. The money's in a bank, cause the safe got more guns than it could hold. And we all got ice on the watch like Border Patrol. But I'm yeah. Yeah. Well, he's cold, yeah. It's like... His image, I'm not saying they're anything alike, but his image is a little Big K-ish. Yeah. I, I hate to I'm compare saying, every yeah. white dude to Big K, but but like... Oh, I'd be so happy if I got compared to Big K. Yeah, no Big idea. K's the GOAT, bro. But, yeah. but like, I, I feel like he doesn't... He's saying cold shit, but he's not overperforming it. Like, yeah. It's almost like he's just going through it. And a lot of other people that would rap like that, you'd say his performance is bad. 
but it's so nonchalant. It's like it feels like we're bothering him by being in the room. Yeah, that's a great, you know, that's like, a great way. Of, <laughs> it feels like we're bothering him. Like, sorry, that for is paying such to come a great see example you. of like it's dope. The, yeah, of like like why are y'all like we shouldn't be here. So, this is sorry, like, I'm so sorry. Sorry, girl. Sorry, yeah. I paid to come. I, see yeah. you. <laughs> I fucked up. That's, that's a great dope, example. Man. But yeah, man. Yeah, Chrome, Chrome is fire, bro. This is a gem, bro. So like, yeah. yeah if I watched a bunch of his battles, he's got gems in there, huh? Yeah, yeah. I mean, he doesn't battle much at all um, anymore uh, because I don't think I just don't think he got that many looks. Um, hmm. And also, you got to remember for like for for guys like this, it's kind of a hard because King of the Dot stopped doing things for a while, yeah. and when that happened, a lot of battlers kind of lose their main like mm -hmm. like you know where you kind of aspire to get into. Yeah. Um, I got very lucky with like URL, but like a lot of these guys didn't have that opportunity and so it's like uh yeah that kind of kind of screws him up yeah and, um this but, is dope man this is someone i would genuinely if i saw this by myself i'd click on another battle yeah this to be like, very very good the this is just something random for me like when i get hip to a cool battler the next battle i click on is the hugest make or break i guess it's similar yeah. like, to a music business like if you have a hit it's like what's your follow-up yeah it's a great point but i'm like if like if Chrome has another battle that I click on, he was just mediocre in it. I'd probably never click on another yeah. battle for another year, just because there's so much battle rap yeah, out there. You it's know a what great I mean? Point. But like the second click is always so important. That's why like me, I always feel a little insecure because I have such like great performances and then such bad ones. There's not a lot like in the middle. Yeah. You know? But like no matter like what you click on an Emerson Kennedy battle might be fucking phenomenal. It might be like who the fuck is he? You know, I've never watched this shit. That's again, interesting. You know, well, that's why we're talking about like like. I never have never taken more than like five battles in a year mm -hmm. because for me I've always been really conscious of like that exact reason where I do not want there to be a battle on YouTube where it's like oh god just do not watch this one this one's the really bad I really I didn't care about this one at all I just I kind of just you know bro you're moving the right way because it sucks yeah it lives it's forever way like, way Fuck better I was shitty in that it's way know? better to have in my opinion to yeah. have like fewer battles but then the ones you do. They're at the very least, they're not bad. There's like stuff you can go like, okay, this one, this is like, this is it. There's enough here, hopefully, to continue to make you a fan. Yeah. Um. But yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, All right. You got, man? So I'm gonna continue the trend of people you know very well. Okay. <laughs> this this person, I, I think probably a lot of people know him. You definitely know him. Um. And he probably almost wouldn't go on the underrated list. He's very unique in the sense that I see this happen a lot with battle rap. They get their opportunity early then their opportunity kind of goes away because they're not the bright new face anymore. And then they figure it out after that. Mm. Then like their opportunity is kind of like, not gone per se, but it's like most people won't click on another battle of theirs because the early opportunity they saw him, they didn't like him. Yeah. It's next. Mm, man, now a lot point. of people hate his voice or some shit or they just like, he <sighs> for some reason he got a lot of unwarranted hate when he did the URL tournament. Yeah. Next was a heavy punchliner, and I think when he battled Nitty, like shortly afterwards, which is a great battle, he put down the wordplay as much, and now he's been talking real shit a lot in his battles. And I've always been a fan of his, but to me, I hate always comparing because people will be like, that's not him, but like now he's rapping a little bit in the same vein of like Calico, mm -hmm. where it's not forcing wordplay, but just talking street shit that's not wordplay, but saying slick shit. and. His last like four or five battles, I'm probably a bigger Next fan than like 90% of battle rap. I'm like really high on him yeah. right now. And it sucks because I'm like, I wish he would, he would have found this before when he had the URL looks. Yeah. Uh, but he'll get back on because he's just so fucking talented. You can't keep good talent down. But yeah. Next is fucking incredible, bro. So Next was in my Crucible class, but okay. he had the LeBron James type of like problem mm. where they made him skip the process and they said we'll put you it was it was a mess they like did. the, the That's whole right. season 1 of the crucible was a complete mess because mm -hmm. like cuz next is so good but i also was like but when i heard that he's skipping the crucible and then just like getting into like the thing i was going that's a bad like i would have probably done that too like so i wouldn't have to do the like but i feel like you need to be a lebron james superstar yeah. twerk rapping now yeah. to be like that level of because battle rap if if it battle rap fans hate getting told what's good 100%. they love determining that themselves and if and if you're getting the push of like and he kind of leaned into it i feel i feel like he leaned into like because i think he like made it like mr skip the process mr yeah. all those things and it's like i just don't know if that was the right thing and people start calling you a plant and i don't know if he had i think he's got a great I don't know if he has the personality outside of the ring to be able to kind of diffuse that. I feel and that. so, but he's so unbelievably talented. If you can, I, I don't mind his voice thing. Like, yeah. But 
I know, I know a lot of battle rap fans don't like it for some reason. If you can just like suspend that for a little while and listen to his style and the way he's rapping now, bro, I think he's like rapping at maybe like a top twenty level right now. I'm gonna show you the which one. And this one's good. It's him and Young Cannon. It's uh -huh. his last round versus Young Cannon. And I wanted to show you this because oh, God. it's important that we know who Young Cannon is, too. Because he takes his thirds. This is the Geechee effect. Like, his third round's just real shit. Mm -hmm. And next is, like, slogan is, like, I don't care if you liked this round. I did it for me. It's not word for word. He says it differently. But he talks to Young Cannon. And it, it, he raps in a way that, like, battle rap is slowly losing, which is, like, someone right on your shoulder talking to you directly about your fucking life. And when you're... As well known as Young Cannon, people know enough about him to be like, oh, fuck, I know that about him. He's been around long enough. And I just think this round, it's no clever wordplay. I just think the aggression and how he's saying real shit and really rapping to Young Cannon is really fucking amazing, man. All right. So. I want to say, I've been, I was wanting to say something about this this event. This is your boy Quip. I've never met him before, but mm -hmm. as a first new film's battles... Man, he's really good. He seems he's talented as fuck. Really good. I think yeah. he also battles too. But like, he's really good. Yeah. And this this event specifically, I don't do many like independent leagues for the reason that like we just saw with like the the, the Chrome like battle that shot very poorly. Like yeah, very poorly. Um, and uh, that, that to defend the eye battle, that was a there was a lot of things going on with the camera situation at that time. But like, but with this dude, it looks it looks. Oh, it's this shot you're on too. They have yeah. a wide that's okay, but this shot, yeah, is the so up close, fucking yeah. Good, well, also, it's not even, it's not it's, it's it's a great combination of like great cinematography, but also it's the venue. This venue looks amazing, cool color. and this is where I like, do. I will happily battle at this league hmm. if it can look like this. I just I just want Dope. it to look like this. It looks Dope. oh, it looks so cool. It's, I All right, so tell see. you when you. Yeah. If you, I could have healed. Tide, you get washed when my jeans stain them. Blood lacking on a crib block. He gonna see danger. Grab the fifth before I club next. Let's get oh, the pre game. And it was cool that How young Ken was able to make it after he was driving How the limousine. Yeah, no, I know you can't. We really can't trash uh, Fresco for his outfit. If like this, <laughs> if this, this, is, yeah, we gotta, this looks like he just like went straight into Steve Harvey's closet and like. Just straight up jack this, man. He <laughs> should be on the Kings of Comedy with this outfit, bro. Yo, this Kevin, we fuck with you, buddy, but are you dealing cards, yeah. my nigga? I don't this know. This is insane. He doesn't drive limos. He he takes the seats from the limos, the, the leather from the seats, and makes a, makes a, makes a jacket out of it. Yo, this Kevin, is... you look like you're about to smoke a long, skinny cigarette. <laughs> 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 Man, I'm a 2 out. Niggas still ain't changing his shoes. Cool. Niggas still got shoes. <laughs> I don't know what we missed. There. I don't know what that is. That's bizarre. That little fade into yeah. like, all right. Like this third round, knowing you're not a threat until I chalked it up as an extra kill. I wasn't even thinking about you. I was laying with a baddie, sending tracking numbers. I'm a better heel. You better heel. They don't think you get the respect you deserve, and you never will. You know how you test respect? Chill, help him build, take him to the spot, let him see everything you got. If it's any questions still, then you know it was never real. Dope. I know this, I know this ain't, I know this ain't got shit to do with canon, mm -hmm. but we speak two different languages. I bet they understand me. When the plug call you family, you ain't gotta worry about them underhanding. The Jack boys probably up like half a ticket, but nigga, we come from robbing. We can't even be mad they did it. You worried about a. I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted by the, by the, by the audio. The audio is on this. That's because, like, I, uh, I've never seen this work. I've never seen the clip on mics work. They're terrible. Uh, yeah, They're I hate terrible. it. Because the audio is so good, but then until it's not, it's really good. But then when it's not, or when there's a loud reaction and it just gets sounds muffled, it's yeah. like, oh, yeah, no. I feel you. So I shot I mics. Everything you got. If it's any questions still, yeah. then you know it's it was real. never real. I know this. I know this ain't. I know this ain't got shit to do with canon. But we speak two different languages. I bet they understand me. When the plug call you family, you ain't gotta worry about them underhanding. The Jack boys probably up like half a ticket. But nigga, we come from robbing. We can't even be mad they did it. Mm. You worried about a punch? The Jack boys probably up like half a ticket. But nigga, we, we come, come from, from robbing. robbing. We can't even be mad they, they did, did, it. did it. You worried about a punchline and if a fan predicts it? I'm trying to see if that van got them bands that that man is missing. I could admit, I could admit, I could admit there was times I was saying, let's stop. We done seen more bread than our parents before the check dropped. We done sold Asian weed to a geek on a desktop. So many China packs, they can open up a sweatshop. I used to look. On his, uh, he's on his ear too. You yeah. know what I mean? Like, yeah. this is the type yeah. of shit. Yeah. Like, there's little cheats in battle rap that if you're not speaking directly to your opponent with the content, 
speak to him physically. Yeah. And it'll look better on camera. Yeah, That's exactly absolutely. what Next is doing. You know what absolutely. I mean? Absolutely. Hey, I could admit. I could have, I, I could have. And with, and with the microphone, I know I'm a nerd here, but like, mm -hmm. with the microphone, since he is so close to his voice, it almost, it, it feels like he's almost talking to us because the audio source is so close. Like it, does, it has that effect where it's like, he's right up in his ear and he's also yeah. right up in our ear too. Do you think they're using audio from Cannon's mic too or do you think they shut it off? They probably, they probably turn it off. Uh -huh. uh, but again, I don't know. I don't, that's why I never use these because I, yeah. I never know how to, you know. It was times I was saying, let's stop. We didn't see more bread than our parents before the check drop. We didn't sold Asian weed to a geek on a desktop. So many China packs, they could open up a sweatshop. I used to love this battle rap and shit. Now it's just a place where I could vent. Mm -hmm. All the funds that I'd have spent. All the cars I got to rent. If you compare it to the trap money, it wouldn't make a dent. You see me from the start, can say a word that you done lent. When did you ever play your part? We really welcome you on the west so i'm expecting nothing less or we gonna take it as disrespect yeah cannon got bars but we're the rest no personality and we hate the way you dress <laughs> bars he's really like on him yeah bro. you know what i mean like yeah and this is what next has been doing so fucking well like if you can't fuck with the content you have to fuck with his conviction he, yeah a hundred percent but he also he has like that's where I don't understand. I understand why people don't don't like the content. Like because right now he's not punching a lot, but when he does punch, he's incredible. Yeah. He's gotten so many bars, which is like. But he can also go into this bag, and like yeah, like you said, the conviction is just so mm. good. There's just not a lot of things to dislike about this guy, yeah. which is weird that you know. <laughs> yeah, crazy. Hey, we really welcomed you on the West. I'm expecting nothing less, so we're gonna take it as disrespect. Yeah, Cannon got bars, but we're the rest. Where? No personality, and we hate the way you dress. Fast. You know why Nitty only needs punches? Cause he the best. Fast. You're not even top 20, and we done checked. When the, when the Midwest was moving, they ain't mentioned you in no Midwest movement. He's trying to decide if he the old Midwest or the new one. He God. the mid Midwest, that ain't do nothing. Still a <laughs> Bro, you see what I'm saying? Like, That's crazy. I'm jealous that I can't do this and Battle Rap's losing it. And yeah. it probably should because it's giving way to more creativity, but I still am a sucker for yeah. this shit, bro. Talking to his soul. Yeah, that's that's a very when surf. When the, when the Midwest was moving, they ain't mention you in no Midwest movement. He's trying to decide if he don't Sorry. Hold what, what I love about this, though, specifically with, for me, uh, is that I love the things where, where it doesn't really, like, I think that he thought about what would hurt if I was Big Cannon, that's what I always try to do. If I was Big Cannon, what would hurt me to hear? Yeah. And that's what I always try to do with my opponent. I, I, I try to go, I go like, okay, if I, w if I woke up as this person and looked in the mirror, what's the things that I wouldn't want people to talk about? Yes. And, I'm, and then that's exactly, you're right. It's that, it's that thing like, you don't even know like what class you're in because you haven't really taken off in either one. And it's that's gonna hurt a... when you watch it back. Like I have had battles where I've done that to people and people have done that to me. Mm -hmm. And a lot of the time, the crowd won't go crazy for it. But when you see that person at another event, you're like, oh, you talk to my soul. Or like, you know I talk to you. you yeah. I mean, like, it's yeah. like a different pride thing where it's like, I don't give a fuck if they're fucking with it, but like, I'm talking to you. Yeah. You know? Yeah, I'm not here for anything else other than to hurt you. Yeah. That's what I, yeah. oh, that's what I love about Battle Rap. <laughs> yeah. New one. He the mid Midwest. I ain't do none. Still a <laughs> mid Midwest. <laughs> When the Midwest was moving, they ain't mention you in no Midwest movement. He trying to decide if he the old Midwest or the new one. He the mid Midwest that ain't do nothing. Still a vet trying to prove something. I ain't the nigga you gonna prove it with. Whip full with hooligans. Zip sold for two blues. I'm trying to 32 some shit. Go home, go home from the back end and 30 you again. Nigga, I'm in your city. Nigga, I'm in your city. Really telling you what it is. And I can feel the animosity floating up in this bitch. But real niggas know I ain't lying. This shit legit. If the niggas, be, if the niggas behind you can't tell you when you lack then that's a risk. If you give the niggas behind you a pass, then that's a pitch. We all addicted. Oh. Gosh. Do you see how it's that's like, crazy? I mean, I like I, I compare people sucks, but do you see how it's a little calico is? Yeah, it's also a little geeky, like with like like how he's breaking mm. things down in a way that like I don't know, in a way that I can understand it. Like where yeah. I'm getting it, where I'm like, oh, it's it's like it's digestible for like me. Yeah. Cal sometimes yeah. will say stuff where I'm just like. I, this sounds so cool. I don't. I, I'm gonna I have to take no, your word for there's it. There's just that. so there's yeah. so many things. Where I'm like, I don't know. Like this, I've caught all of it. Yeah. You know, like I, I, it's it's really well packaged. He can't he can't rap like this at all. Not better at all. I'm better than that. He can't rap like that. Also, you know when Nex saw him walk in wearing this outfit, oh, no, he was like, hey. "You couldn't have that. You couldn't have done it better." Thank you so much. I really appreciate hey. it. <laughs> you know why, Nitty? You know why Nitty only needs punches? 
cause he the best. You not even top 20 and we didn't check. When the Midwest was moving, they ain't mention you in no Midwest movement. He trying to decide if he the old Midwest or the new one. He the mid Midwest that ain't do nothing. Still a vet trying to prove something. I ain't the nigga you gonna prove it with. Whip full with hooligans. Zip sold for two blues. I'm trying to 32 some shit. Go home, flip the back end and 30 you again. Nigga, nigga, I'm in your city. Really telling you what it is. And I can feel the animosity floating up in this bitch. But real niggas know I ain't lying. This shit legit. If the niggas behind you can't tell you when you lacking, then that's a risk. If you give the niggas behind you a pass, then that's a pitch. We all addicted to money and that's the itch. I started hustling because I was, I started hustling because I was bummy with no cash to flip. I know niggas that are hungry where it's muddy really match your shit. Circle the crib but don't rap a lick. I could have lapped you on accident. This nigga decent. Not even someone I could compete with. They told you you could win, but did they mean it? You acting like that ain't hit, but that's just defense. I don't know what happened with Shine, but I don't need it. I can't speak on a situation if I ain't see it. But it, but it bothers you when niggas bring it up, so I believe it. <laughs> That's great. This for us. I don't give a fuck about what these niggas think. Told you it bothered them. This for us. I don't give a fuck about what these niggas think. It's a chain reaction in my city. They probably killed the missing link. They gotta remember me. And I should snuff you because you an op and you an enemy. I only battle rap because what it did for me. Don't give a fuck if you like this round. It's about what it meant to me, nigga. Mm. See, that's like, uh, I, said, I don't know, man. That style of rap I'm always gonna love, bro. I'm yeah. always gonna love because I think... For multiple reasons, because it feels authentic when I'm watching it. And two, I feel it's the minority now in Battle Rap. Yeah. I think it's hard to get that. Yeah. Yeah. I think you're 100% right when you said, like, the, the punching and doing, like, the twerk nitty wordplay is becoming so drawn out. I oh felt, because God. I felt like, I feel like name flips were that, like, I feel like name flips started just dying, like, two or three years ago. Yeah. It's just, there's just no, we're just doing it to death. Uh-huh. And it's kind of getting to be like that with just, like, just punching in general. Mm-hmm. And things like this that, like, kind of used to be more popular then kind of died out. And then I like how things kind of come back around in battle rap, which is, like, why Mr. Biscuit and Fresco, like, their styles are, are more relevant today than they were five years ago, but they've been doing it for so, like, like right. styles just kind of come back. And mm-hmm. I'm glad this, this, this style is kind of coming back, too. It's dope, man. It's really dope. Next is the homie. I think maybe this is a little West Coast bias to me, but I feel like he really knows who he is in this battle rap space. He's really comfortable with it. And I mm-hmm. hope he gets, like... Not that it's a second chance, but he had such a push in the beginning that, like you said, fans can grow like an animosity towards it if they feel like you're being force fed this specific artist, mm-hmm. you know? But I just think he's rapping at an incredibly high level. If you guys are fans of Next, watch any of his last couple of battles. He's just been rapping his ass off. He has one against Reverse Live. Him and Hansel is a movie that released like two years ago. He's just got a lot of really yeah. quality shit out there. Man. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. That's a great pick, man. Thanks, man. All right. So, That's, uh, Chrome. Number Chrome. And next. Yeah. Yeah. We're getting uh, through it. We're speeding through this. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. That's uh, episode three, man. Uh, we, got, we got seven more to go. Okay. All right. Thank you all for tuning in.